Hello everyone, my name is Jun Young Kim. My name is Shiva, and our project is Bidirectional People's Counter using only discrete logic. And here is the diagram that we're using. Okay. So here's the circuit diagram that we have. This is these are two LEDs, phototransistors. These phototransistors are connected to supply through 51K resistors. Uh, here's is a NAND gate chip, 7400LS, and this is a D flip flop, which is uh, 74 ls 4 uh, 74 and this is connected to these these uh d flips are connected to the output of the d flip flops is connected to the uh, uh, decade counters um these are two decade counters 74 ls 192s and then there's we have a decoder which is 74 ls 47 which is connected to a uh, seven segment display so here is a push button that is pretty much going to be which is pretty much going to work as our clear for the decade counters. One more thing that we also implemented our own default flops using uh, NAND gates, um, and here's a picture. So as you can see that I have blocked one of the phototransistors, which is the output of the phototransistors is going into the default flop. So at this point, the output, the input of the D input is high. However, we have to manually clock it. So he clocked it, and then we'll see that it will produce an up count on this side. So by blocking the LED, we sent a signal to up counter to increase the count by one. So as you can see, this is 0, 0, 0, 1. So when you decode it from the binary to decimal, it's one. So blocking the LED by once has up counted it, the counter by one. So as you can see, I will block the LEDs again and clock it twice this time. So after clocking twice, the count of the, the counter should have gone by two. So after coming on this side, you can see that zoom in, it is 0011. So 0011 in BCD translates to three in decimal. So now we're going to demonstrate the down count for the circuit. So I'm going to block an LED which signifies down count. So when I block it, he's going to clock it once. After clocking, we will see that the count on this side of the circuit should decrease by one. Earlier it was 0011 and now it's 0010. So earlier it was three, now it's two. So our circuit counts down as well. So here, this concludes our video that our circuit, which is count up and count down works. Thank you.